what's going on everybody johnny coming at you with another video we're gonna do a quick rip here of some ttm fuel for those of you that don't know what ttm is ttm is through the mail um you can do through the mail autographs from i mostly do baseball players but you can do anything anybody no limits but for me mostly sports and mostly baseball but um, you can go as far back as you can. We got some signers that are in their 90s that still sign all the way up to training camps. Well, I practice mostly on um, 60s, 70s, 80s, and early 90s. And as I open more, we're going to kind of save more. But I wanted to, you got to have fuel, guys. And by fuel means you got to have cards. Um, and I was able to win. A contest from a fellow youtuber patrick uh baseball cards and ttm got us a rack pack of uh 1990s fleers which is great for ttms and i don't have a a lot of uh, fleer 90 autographs so we'll get looking for those and then we're looking for uh looks like we got some 1989s uh, I'm sorry, 88 tops. Nice. So this stuff is great fuel. And then we'll rip a few packs of the Leaf uh, Series 1, uh, the Leaf set, which really pretty cards. Newer, a little bit newer cards. As I say, newer cards meaning 90s and early 90s. But um, but yeah, let's see what we got here. Let's, let's, let's roll with this one here first, guys. Patrick, I really appreciate some of these older stuff. I really like only opening older stuff and this stuff is really good for autographs okay right on top there all-star dave winfield very nice uh let's see here we got Roden. oh that, there's my boy right there nolan ryan heck yeah how many no hitters seven that's right a lot of people don't realize how many one hitters he has he has like 11 or 12 which is insane among other things. So that is sweet. Uh, Mario Soto. There's uh, Juan Soto's Pappy. Obedi. I'd be a McDowell. I've sent to him. I haven't gotten him back yet. Um, there's the record breakers of the Eddie Murray there. Ron Bloomberg. He actually signs, I think. I don't know. I'll take that back. Doyle Alexander's passed away. Roger McDowell. And the Kevin Mitchell. Cool, cool, cool. I love these cards. All right, next one here. Again, guys, if you haven't, I know you have, but if you haven't, check out Patrick's baseball cards and TTMs. He does a lot of TTM videos like I do. He does old rips, new rips. Go give him a like. Go give him a subscribe. Tim Bertus, he signs. That's pretty cool. Mickey Telderton, Keith Miller, Castillo, Todd Benzinger, Andy Allenson, and Dwight Gooden. For my Mets fans, there you go, Dan. Doc, Dan, Dan, Doc. <laughs> Over there at Mets Rules. All right, we'll go to this last section here. And we'll hit up these uh, 90 Fleers. Cal Daniels signs for a small fee. Jamie Quirk autographs. Stanley Miller. Gary Gaetti. Whirl. Mike Mason. Dave Schmidt signs. Ronicky signs, I believe. Plesak. Mm, I think he's. I don't know. Chris James and Steve Lake. Very cool. I love that. All right, next thing. Let's go and bust open these 1990 Fleers. That should be cool. First one here. Charlie O'Brien. Luis De Los Santos. Jeff Enos. John Farrell. Tom Browning. Denny Walling. Allenson. Samuel. Some of these guys I'm going to have to check. Devereaux. Charlie Hayes, the great Bobby Witt signer. Let's see what we got. In what season did the Braves win the National League West? What season was that? Uh, like 
90, 91, I don't know, when was it? 96, uh, 69, and 82. Well, nowhere close. Okay. Charlie O'Brien. I got these already. All right, guys. Next one. All right. Like I said, these guys, these are really Molitor signs, but he's a kind of a high fee. Aquino, Tim Tufel. I, I guess he doesn't sign. I've tried several times to get his autograph. Bud Black. There's old Norm Carlton. Ted Power, great signer. Orsico signs right now. Ojeda. Lee Gutterman signs. Darren Dalton, rest in peace. Alright, last one. And we'll hit up these Leaf 93s. <sighs> Ken Obukfell. <laughs> Mitch Williams, Dan Pleasac, Daryl Hamilton, there's old Matt, uh, Pat Tabler, their sweet music himself, Frank Viola signs for $5, Doug Jones, great signer, John Franco, there's Mark Davis, Mitch Williams, Joey, don't call me Albert Bell, Kevin Reynolds, oh, there's Cal Ripken Jr., that's always nice. And league standouts of Jose Gensejo. Pretty cool card. All right. Very, very nice. All right, guys, let's rip a few of these. I don't know if you guys remember opening these back in the day. I do. I was still collecting during this time. This is when the cards started getting really fancy with the photography and, and the shininess. So here we go. You know what's the cool thing about these front cards? A lot of these back of the cards look really cool. Look at that. Half of these times, I kind of want them to sign both sides. You know what I mean? I might have to tell them that because sometimes the back of these cards are better than the front. I mean, look at that. Isn't that sweet? Like I said, I don't know if you guys remember them. I just got one. No, I didn't. I had Juan Guzman took a while for me to get back, actually. I got Jose Guzman back. Tartable signs for a small fee. Look at that. Sweet. Really like these. Robin Yount, Hall of Famer. There's a Derek Bell. Good old Juan gone himself. Used to hit the bombs back in the day. There's Mike Greenwell. Oh, there you go. Frank. Aggressive. The Big Hurt. We all know the Big Hurt. <laughs> Mike Piazza. Enough shout out there to Dan over there. He loves old Mike Piazza. I'm going to have to send him this card if he doesn't. I'm sure he has it. He has every Mike Piazza, I'm sure. Kurt Schilling, and we got Albert Bell again, but really sweet looking cards, guys, if you ask me. Uh, I'll probably have to prep these cards. There's different ways to prep cards, guys. I'll probably do a video soon on that. I don't, like I said, I don't do a lot of newer cards, so I don't try to prep too many, but there's some chromes out there that, there's a couple of techniques. Sometimes I use one, sometimes I use a few different things. If I really want to make sure an autograph comes comes off uh, correctly, um, especially if you're paying for an autograph. <laughs> but these look really nice with an autograph. Jack Morris, Gerald Williams, Pete Harnish, Luis Gonzalez, uh, Bernard Gilkey. But look at some of these, even look at that St. Louis Arch. Like I said, man, these back of these cards look just as cool as the front of the cards i might i haven't thought about that but i'm, I'm thinking about in the letter i might ask if they don't mind instead of sending a lot of, a lot of cards i'll just ask them if they'll send uh you know sign the front and the back of the cards it's rick sutcliffe and they're turned every which way vanderwall checklist my favorite 
Ken Hill signs for a small fee. Andy Bean signs. Jeff Kent. I think Darren Fletcher signed, I'm pretty sure. Dave Walters. Mose Alou and Kurt Schilling. Real quick, go through the back so you can see. So. All right, last pack, guys. I appreciate you watching. We've got 10 minutes already on this video. Guys, if you don't mind, if you weren't too bored, even if you were bored, if you don't mind, hit that like button. Think about subscribing. I do multiple videos a day in a week. Doing everything from these old cards to brand new cards. Ted Power, that's pretty cool. I don't have that card. That's going to get autographed. Um, but yeah, I'd love for you guys to come along for the ride. Please comment. Think about liking. Let me know what you think about some of these cards. Do you remember these cards? I think they would look pretty good with some ink on it guys so like i said i'm gonna flash the backs here real fast because like backs are looking good look at the a's even look good <laughs> shout out to my boy isaac all right guys you know what they do johnny out <laughs>